Good morning, friends. I am annoyed. I've just made myself a very gorgeous cup of coffee and come outside. And then I injected a cow that had withheld its afterbirth, uh, the one that had the dead calf. And um, she walked away and I sprayed um, diatrim all over and it went in my coffee. And I didn't realize, so then I've just taken a little swig and yes, you guessed it, it, um, it was rather tangy. It, that's a really weird taste, I must admit. So me and Roy are just getting some slurry out to make that grass grow on the fields that we've just taken silage off. And that chicken looks like it wants to get run over. Is this a joke? Is this actually a joke? What are you all doing? This is crazy. Oh no. I won't lie, this last 24 hours has been absolute carnage, carving wise. Like this field, they've literally been spitting them out every hour. It's crazy, like proper crazy. I think, you know, like when you, you, your sheep go with their cycles, I'm presuming someone will correct me that this is what's happened with these. So obviously we had the first wave when we had like loads in a day, two days. And I think this is like the second wave of the cycle. I'm gonna go and, if I need to join in, I'm just gonna watch her. That's what I'm gonna do. Let's just sit, children. Let's just sit and survey those gorgeous thistles behind her. I mean, when putting oneself all over the internet, what more would you want to see is some glorious thistles because you know, Good farmers and all that. We are the superhuman, indestructible, wild party animals. Horizon is changing. That's not her car chain. This one here, a little bit earlier on, uh, just starting out. Lovely, get that ball out. I won't lie. Whoever told me that I wouldn't like carving outside, you're a hundred percent right. Hundred percent right. I am not keen on this. This is too. I'm missing something. 
Oh, look, ball's all the way out now. How excited. Um, <laughs> did you see that? <laughs> That's funny. So they're both at the same point really now. Although may be a brew. <laughs> They're lying. They are lying. They've been there. So I can 110% see where whoever said you will find your calving paddock will be basically a hive of infection because there's afterbirth everywhere. Totally take your point. Um, we have been calving technically in here for a day and a half and there is bits of afterbirth and gunk everywhere. And I'm just like, why is she letting that calf suck off her? That is not her calf. This is carnage. I can't even tell you how, you know like when a suckler has a calf, it squirrels the calf off to a corner and runs away with it and it protects its calf and you know they're really like you know they're like oh no one go near my calf no one go near my calf these things it's a free-for-all i'm not even joking like an actual free-for-all you do not need my help go on I'll tell you what i will do then Just... Twins, that's fun. Um, I'm no longer clean. Yay. I'm just waiting for this cow in front of me that we saw this morning. I'm waiting for it to lie down. Then I can just have a little, uh, a tiny helper. She's been on now for, I mean, what time did I first show her to you? Two and a bit hours. That's enough. Do you know what I mean? That is enough. We don't want any longer. And she's more preoccupied with stealing other people's calves than she is with having her own. Um, ideally, I would like to bring her in, but I don't want to knock her off her flow completely um, and make it a bad calving. So, this cow here is also starting to calve. Can you see how she's led down and she's like licking the eye a little bit? She's looking a bit uncomfortable. Her ears are back. She's hanging her out, that kind of thing. So I'm kind of just stood, to be perfectly honest, stood in a field watching these two twinsies <laughs> trying to stand up that's the cutest thing ever 
just waiting for his car to lie down. I think I'll just grab the carbonate just for a little bit of a, not, not for, I could probably pull it, but my arms are hurting. Sizable, sizable. Come on, stand up for me. <laughs> See if I can get these two guys to stand next to each other. Bottom round. There. Right. There is a vast difference in size. This is the calf I need to give a hand to. Um, and this is the calf that obviously slips out on its own. There's literally a difference in the thickness. Sorry, let me go up here. Of their necks the broadness of the backs, the asses, the size is, you can see, like, completely different. Um, the size of their heads, that one's very, like, feminine and small, very heifery. And this one is obviously big and beefy. Its legs are bigger. Everything about it is bigger. Hence why it needed a hand. So... I've just given that thing over there out of the field some electrolytes um, because it's got the SH1Ts. Now, I think it's got the SH1Ts because it's going, it's been going around stealing milk off lots of things. Um, so I'm just going to put... I'm leaving them in here on purpose so that I can wash it down tomorrow. And Tracy and Uncle Kyle are on their way to pick up Rufus uh, to take him to a steam rally in Barney Castle. He will love it. Absolutely love it. Um, yeah, one of the downsides of farming we don't talk about nearly enough is that you literally miss out on 
everything you miss out on everything you do and yeah it's hard work sometimes but yeah Ruth's is gonna absolutely love it um they are they are so good with the kids honestly is this not just the sweetest little puffin duffin oh some wiry wiry wick do you find when they've been when they've been born in a field they're slightly more wick than a normal calf that's been born in a shed or is it the breed because these that have been born in the field they're like <sighs> predator go on Nazi. take your calf take it thank god Rose here good girl well done I can honestly tell you everything is so expensive. Like, that's my overwhelming comments going into dairy. Everything is expensive. The feed's expensive, the boluses are expensive, the dry couches are expensive. Everything is expensive. 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 Okay, so I'm gonna leave that video there. I really need to get on editing it because it is actually probably um, a half an hour before you're due to watch it, um, which is really rubbish of me because I've been so lazy and so busy. I've not been able to sit down and do it. So I'm gonna get on with doing this. Thank you very much for watching. If you made it to the end, you deserve a medal. As always, love you long time and see you next time. <laughs>